So this is a tutorial to show you how to do a strawberry granny square. It's not my pattern, I'm following it from the book above. So if you want to finish the um, granny square, you will have to buy the book. But I will show you the first few rounds. So to start, you're going to do a magic ring or a magic circle. I call it a magic ring. In this tutorial, I will be talking in American terms. Then you're going to chain three. I'm also using, instead it says in the book, a 2.75 hook. I'm actually using a 3 millimeter. Once you've done your chain three, you're going to do two double crochet. Then you're going to chain two. And then you're going to do three double crochet. Then you're going to chain two. Three double crochet, chain two, just pulling it tight a little bit, three double crochet. chain two and join to the top of your chain three with a slip stitch. Then you're going to chain three. That counts as your first double crochet. Then you're going to do a double crochet in each of the next two stitches. And then in the chain space, you're going to do two double crochet. Then you're going to chain two and do another two double crochet. Then you're going to do a double crochet in each of the next three stitches. And then in the chain space, you're going to do two double crochet. Chain two. And then two more double crochet. And then again, in the next three stitches, you're going to do a double crochet. Then in the chain space, you're going to do two double crochet. Chain two. And then two double crochet again. Then in each of the next three stitches, you're going to do a double crochet. And then you're going to do two double crochet in the chain space. Chain two, two double crochet again. And 
and then you're going to slip stitch into the top of the chain three and that's the end of round two here you're going to chain two and then you're going to join and change to your red which makes the bottom part of the strawberry so i just do a slip knot pop it over the bottom of the hook and then I just go straight into five half double crochets in the same stitch and I make sure that my yarn tails are underneath my stitches because then it's less sewing or less weaving in ends so like I said five half double crochet in the next stitch Then I just pick up the white and I do a half double crochet in the next three stitches. In the book it actually tells you to fasten these colours off but I just find it easier to trail the yarn underneath rather than all the ends that you'd have to weave in afterwards. Now in the chain space you want to do two double half half double crochet sorry and then you want to chain two and then do another two half double crochets then you're going to half double crochet in the next three stitches Then you're going to just pull up the red and instead of using the white you just use the red and you're going to do five half double crochets in the next stitch. Then you're going to change back to the white and you're going to do another three half double crochet in the next three stitches. Then you're going to do two half double crochet, chain two, two half double crochet in the next chain stitch, chain space. I did a double there instead of a half, so I'm just correcting it then you're going to do a half double crochet in each of the next three stitches still holding all the yarn tails so that I don't have to weave them in later And then we're going to swap back to red and we're going to do another five half double crochets in the next stitch I think you've probably got the pattern by now so after this it's going to be three half double crochets in the next three well, sorry one half double crochet in the next three stitches then you'll be back to your chain space which is two half double crochet chain two two half double crochet etc etc
So here I'm just doing the last half double crochet in each three stitches before I get to the last chain space. Gone off camera here, but in my last chain space, I'm obviously doing two half double crochet, chain two, two half double crochet. And then what you need to do is rather than doing three half double crochets after the last chain space, you just need to do two. And then you need to um, slip stitch to the top of your first chain two. And that ends round three. There we go, that's the end of round three. And then you need to fasten off your red. I don't actually knot it. Oh, you also need to fasten off your white at the same time. I don't knot it, I just um, crochet over the top of it. But what you need to do is you need to reattach your... Um, you just need to reattach your white yarn into a chain space. And then in that space, you do a stand in half double crochet, a half double crochet, then you chain three and you do two half double crochet each in the next in that same chain space. Sorry, I'll get better at this whole camera malarkey. Then you need to skip a stitch. And then you need to do a half double crochet in each of the next four stitches. Right, now you need to attach green. I just do that the same way I did the red. Now this bit is a bit more tricky. But what you need to do is you need to do half double crochet five together. So you yarn over, then you go through the first stitch, yarn over, go through the second stitch, yarn over, come back through, go through the third stitch, yarn over, come back through, then you go through the fourth and the fifth. So you end up with 10 loops on your hook. You have to pull, you have to pull it through all 10 loops. It is quite tricky, but actually when you get the hang of it, it's all right. And then you chain one. If you just pull the um, white and the green, it just makes the strawberry a little bit tighter as well. And then once you've chained one, you go back to white and you half double crochet in each of the next four stitches. Give the green a little pull just to make that a little bit tighter there. There you go. Once you've done the four, you then miss a stitch. So you skip a stitch and then you do two half double crochet, chain three, two half double crochet in the chain space. Then again, you skip a stitch and you half double crochet in each of the next four stitches. I'm still wrapping my yarn around, look, 
bringing it all with me so I don't have to keep fastening it off and then bringing it back on. And then you're going to swap to green. And then you're going to do five half double crochet together. Or as the pattern says, five, um, half double crochet five together. Just remember to yarn over each time you go through a stitch. So you yarn over through the back, you yarn over through the front before you go next to the next stitch. And then you go back through all, I think it's like 10 loops on the hook. And then don't forget to do your chain one. And then do four, um, half, no, one half double crochet in each of the next four stitches. Once you've done the first one, just give it a tug to make sure that the green is nice and tight. And then don't forget to skip a stitch. And then in the next chain two space, you are going to, oh, where are we at? I've forgotten. Two half double crochet, chain three, two half double crochet. And then remember to miss that stitch. I made so many mistakes where I kept trying to half double crochet in that stitch. You must make sure you miss the first stitch after the chain space. Right, I'll see you at the end of this round. Same pattern. So we're just doing our last half double crochet five together and chain one. And then we're going to change back to white and we're going to do four half double, uh, one half double crochet in each of the next four stitches. Don't forget to tighten your greens, it just makes it look really nice. Two, three, four, and then you're going to slip stitch to the first stand in half double crochet that you did, and that closes round four. And that's where I'm going to leave it today because otherwise, I feel like I'm, um, yeah, it's a bit copyright, isn't it? But yeah. Enjoy, see if you can make strawberries and something else or buy the book and finish the pattern. Oh, I just end up weaving all the ends in here. Hope you have fun, that's the main thing about it.